What's up? It's James from James's Jet Piles. Um, not really a big plan today. I got a new Exoterra, a tall, small, I believe, like an 18 by 18 by 24. It's gonna go up here. These snakes are gonna go on top. And eventually I'll have two more down here, maybe two more up top. Probably not. Um, I don't wanna have to like get a step stool to be able to reach, but I can just have my little junk pile up there, like reptile stuff, but Besides that, I'll show off some animals in the video, and I'm not gonna set this up just yet, I'm just gonna put it up there. I need, um, well, I'll probably steal a ledge from one of the tub setups, because I'm gonna be taking geckos out of it. And then also, I need more plants, and I need, uh, like this one has a big plastic log in the middle, I need something like that from like Petco for like fish or something, just to take up space in the middle so it's not empty space. But let's get into that. All right, so that's all set up on the rack. I have to feed snakes, feed crested geckos, and I think I might, I might mess with the mouse, but you'll see most of that in just a second. Mess with the mouse, mess with the mice is what I meant. This is Paradise and Cletus. Cletus was my first hatched Paradise I bought at a Reptile show, I can't remember. Pleasanton, the Pleasanton Reptile Show. They're the biggest, and they're gonna go in that one right next to the other one. Um, as soon as I set it up, probably this weekend, if not next weekend, their tank's a little dirty, so I still gotta clean it, but something else will go into this big tote and make use of it. That nice little teal ledge, cyan. Next up for the next tank is gonna be Race Car, who's in shed and fellow down there. They're Next biggest, but I'll probably honestly um, sell one. I'll probably sell fellow at the show. I'll probably save race car, but I also want to get that lily white into one as soon as he's like just big enough for it, because it's an expensive animal and I know I'm gonna keep it. It just makes sense to get him used to that kind of lifestyle. This one's one I definitely want to get into a. An exoterra. He's definitely a holdback. He's on my holdback list. The what do you call it? The flash doesn't do it justice, but I can't really see him without it. But he's just super high contrast, light and dark. Let's see if I back up. That's a little bit better. But something like this, especially my first year, I don't want to breed that. It's just kind of. It's not ugly. It's just not what people want. So I want to keep back the best of the best and breed those. And then next year, when my best of the best are producing really nice geckos, that's when I start selling nice stuff and uh, have a higher profit margin. This boy, hopefully boy, I'll be taken to the show. We'll see how much... Uh, I haven't decided what I'm going to price them at yet, but if I do, it'll be it'll be up there at probably 1500 at least. And then... I'm kind of hoping he doesn't sell just because I've been growing him up and he's right about at that spot where he's going to hit another growth spurg and kind of explode. And after that, I'll probably end up putting him in an Exoterra. Um, I might put three females in there or three unsexed in there just till one of them decides to be a male or not. And then if not, I'll take one of the females out or sell one or put it in another Exoterra that's going to go right there and just call that good. All right, so I just finished up with all the geckos. You'll see a bunch of little clips of those. Now on to the snakes. I don't know how many of them I'll get to today, but whatever I don't get to, I'll get to tomorrow. And those ones ate not too long ago, so we're chilling there.
I know I was going to wait for these bigger snakes, but I don't want to wait. I kind of want to feed them. Come on. Don't be shy. Don't be like that. Oh, 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 oh. There you go. I hope that was in frame. That was cool. Her strikes are always wicked. Oh, oh, she's going to leave it. Okay, I'm going to leave it in there. She'll chew on it eventually. All right, that's kind of it for today. Just a bunch of random little feeding clips. Um, tomorrow, me and my girlfriend are going to my buddy Mondo's house. Uh, he breeds Dry Marcon, Prevos, MBKs, uh, California King Snakes, Florida Speckle King Snakes. He's working on some Carter Snakes. He does all sorts of stuff. Um, I might take some pictures, film a little bit there. We'll see. Um, I'll probably film myself setting some of that up tomorrow. I don't know if I'll finish it tomorrow, but we'll see. Because i got to get a ledge. Actually, I know where I can get a ledge tomorrow for a good price. You'll see me set that up tomorrow. No. I'm James from James's Jeptiles. If you enjoyed this video, like, comment, subscribe. Uh, hit the notification thing if that's what you want. I upload every day. I Sometimes I skip like a day a week just because I'm stressed out from work or if i got a bunch of stuff going on. But at least six days a week, if not seven. Um, hit me up on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, uh, gmail.com, and have a good one.